I haven't put anything on my face yet, so this is my bare face. My skin hasn't been really healthy recently. But anyway, so the first thing I'm gonna do is moisturize my face with this Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Lotion. And I really like this because it's kind of moisturize my face like the whole day. I actually always forget this step, but you should put on some primer. So today I'm gonna use the Professional Primer by Benefit. Put some on my face. I just actually got out of the shower, so my hair might look funny somehow. So for foundation, I usually use this Fit Me foundation by Maybelline. It's in the color 104. I really love this um, foundation. I actually just repurchased it. It's somehow really liquidy, but it's very lightweight. So I just feel like it's something that's suitable for everyday makeup. And I've been loving it. I actually just like put like this on my face. I'm gonna use this um, foundation brush and just kind of blend everything out nicely. I look kind of pale right now, but that's not really my problem because I'm gonna put some bronzer on anyway. Eyebrows are so important, so I'm gonna do it now. This is such a familiar thing, but I'm gonna use the Anastasia Beverly Hills to Brown Pomets in the color granite. Um, you guys already know, I have been doing my eyebrows somehow thinner than before. I don't know why. I just feel like um, it looks better on me. feel like it's almost finished already because like the eyebrows can change everything like literally Shit. now I'm gonna use a big kind of blending brush and then use this color to contour my nose oh by the way this is the shade and lights palettes by Katmandy it's so good I really recommend it I usually use like the darkest shade to contour my like this bit under it It kind of gives the illusion that my nose is actually high, um, but it's not. So, such a sad life. The lighting keeps being on and off because of the sun, but we do have good lighting today. And for this look, I don't usually contour, I bronze because it does give a very summery look. And so I'm gonna use a biggie fan brush. This is like a bigger size, this is like a regular fan brush size. I use a bigger one and I'm gonna mix these two light color and I'm gonna work like this in circular motion. Kind of spread everything out, like bronzing, bronzing. If that makes sense. I don't make everything harsh, just really lightly. It looks dark because this side is like really dark, the windows on this side. And then I put some on my drawing. And then I also bronze my forehead because I have a big forehead. I did my makeup through my viewfinder. That's not a good thing, but I just can't stop looking at the viewfinder. So I don't know how you prefer this look to be, but I usually put some of these two light shades on my eye, just like really lightly, give it some depth. Like nothing, nothing special, just really lightly put it on and blend it out. I also put some underneath my eye. I don't do wing eyeliner for my everyday makeup just because it looks 
kind of dramatic to me. I usually do my eyeliner like this. Just watch. Start right at the end of my eye and kind of wing it up just a little bit. Not like a really dramatic wing. So now I'm gonna curl my eyelashes. For mascara, I'm going to use the Last Sensational by Maybelline. I do feel like my, make my makeup skill today is not so good. So if this video is a flop, then I'm gonna hate myself forever. I don't have much expectation for my eyelashes just because they're so short. Using mascara won't give any difference. So I'm gonna put on some blush. Today I'm gonna use this um, e.l.f. blush palette and I'm gonna use this color just because it's like the lightest shade and it's kind of like a peachy pinky shade. I think it's like so cute. I'm just gonna slap a bunch of them on. So moving to highlighter, my favorite part ever. I'm going to use this shade Forever Young and one for free. I literally fall in love every time I put on this highlighter. No excuses. No excuses at all. I'm gonna put some on my nose. And then also some on my cupid 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 ball. I'm glowing, I'm glowing, I'm ready for summer, I'm so ready for summer, I cannot wait. I'm so done with school and stuff like that. I cannot wait till I can officially finish everything and then start my beautiful, beautiful summer. But anyway, I just bought this new Kylie lip kit and um Wrong one! This one is bougie. I was going to show this one, which is a ginger. I'm not a fan of Kylie or anything, but I just feel like it was trying, so I bought it. And this is ginger. It came with, um, this is a lip kit, so it came with like a pencil, a lip, lip pencil, and then uh, the lipstick. But I'm, I'm going for a natural look, so I won't be using this lip pencil. I'm just gonna put this on. Oh, and most important thing, I'm gonna put on some chapstick, because God knows you need it. So. And I'm just gonna put on the lipstick. It actually smells so good, but I must say that this lipstick is so dry, so you must put on a lot, a lot of lip balm before you put the actual lipstick on. That's my advice. I think this color is so suitable for everyday makeup. Although I just did accidentally put on too much. But that's okay. I fucked up all the time. I already got used to it. So, yeah, this is the finished look. It's so easy. You can probably do this in like 10 minutes or longer. I probably spend longer, but it's easy to recreate. So, that's a good thing. So, I do hope you guys enjoyed this um, tutorial. I just feel like it's summer, so I must do something that related to summer. And so here it is, there you go. This is my everyday makeup summer edition. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and 
I just want to say thank you so much for helping me reach 3,000 subscribers. I mean, that number is like so big to me. Like, I was going to film a 50 facts about me video when I hit 1,000 subscribers, but then like everything happened so fast. Um, and then I reached 3,000. And I might reach 4,000 by the time I upload this video. So, I just want to say uh, thank you, thank you, thank you so, so, so much for all your support. You guys are the best. I, I really appreciate everything that you guys did. And so, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. <laughs> That's all what 